So when we're doing the walking waves, we're not thinking, oh, oh, I'm, go I'm going down and I'm going back and down. No, no, no. We're always thinking, actually, in this video, we are showing you how to do the walking body waves in bachata sensual in the shadow position. So let's go. Tú no llegabas, tú ya no estabas, y en cada noche te vi riendo. No te importaba nada de nada. El mar se calma con el perdón al escucharte. guys so as you just saw we're doing the walking body waves in the shadow position but before we do it with the partner let's first explain how to do it without the partner because if you can do it without the partner you will probably be able to do it with a partner okay so guys we already know how to do a body wave let's start both with the left foot front we're going to show you from the other point of view afterwards okay so let's do the normal body wave first remember we start with the chest in this case in shadow position it's five so we would go here five then the chest goes Back in six, we close the abdomen in seven, and then we do our pendulum on eight. And from here, we would push us again up in one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. For this, it's super important that we are really shifting our weight, that we are really going to the front and then to the back. And remember, guys, common mistake is do not bring your hips to the front. So don't go one. Think about it really with the chest. Bam, and the hips are back. And then it's always the chest, okay? Here, very good. Let's do it from the other point of view. Let's turn around and we go in three, four, five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, four. So guys, this is a small crash course to body waves. If you need a more detailed video, make sure to check out this video over here. But now let's do the walking body waves. Okay guys, so let's start walking with the body wave. We are here on three, four, and we start our basic on five together. Let's go in five, six, and now on seven, I already start my body wave with the chest. I go seven, eight, and then I go one, two. And you see that in the moment when I go to the back and I start closing, that I pull my front leg to the other leg. So in the moment when I pull it back, I can start with this second body wave and change the weight and push out again into the second body wave and close. Let's do it one more time together in three, four, five, Six. We start in seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and then we continue with our basic. Let's do it from the other point of view. In three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, four, and five, six, seven, eight. Do you want to take your bachata sensual skills to the next level? We have an online program where we teach you step-by-step step all the fundamental moves and techniques you need to know to master this dance. If you want to know more information, make sure to check out the first link in the description. But now, let's continue with the video. Yes, guys, so like Magdalena just said, we are pulling the foot back when we are closing here and make sure that you already have your weight on the back. Because if your weight is already here on the back, then this one is free and can actually move very easily and moves with the closing of the chest of the belly. And don't try to like go here, and I don't know how you would be able to switch, it's not possible, so you really have to have your weight on the back, this one is free, and then you can be here, and go in the other body weight. And the other thing guys, is always think about going up. Don't think about the movement going back, or going down. So when we're doing the walking waves, we're not thinking, oh, oh, I'm, go I'm going down and I'm going back and down. No, no, no. We're always thinking actually of growing, but given that our foot, the front one, changed the position to the back, now my front is the back that I had before, if you understood, so here. But I'm always thinking about growing. I'm always thinking that I wanna go up 
and my foot is the one that is deciding we're going backwards. Okay, now it's time to do it with a partner. Yes, guys, so let's get into the shadow position. We're gonna explain super fast how to get in the shadow position. If you don't know how to, or you want some inspiration of different ways to get in the shadow position, check out this other video or the one in the description. But we're gonna do it with a break forward with half turn. So on one, I'm stepping on the front and my hand on her biceps will do a circular movement with her arm. In one. On two, my hand is on the triceps and now I turn her in a half turn. In two, I lose a step, continue the turn, and we both tap with the left foot. Now guys, we need to have a very good frame and also connection. A tip that we give you is to have also connection here. So if the arm is here down or here, make sure to turn it a little bit like this so that her triceps starts facing us and now we can secure the connection by pushing it a little bit towards our chest. And now we have way more connection here and she can feel my movement with my chest and her arm. So from here, like we said, we walk in five, six, five, six, and on seven, we start the body wave. Connection here, connection here, and we go seven, eight, we close in one, the foot starts sliding two, and we push ourselves back again in three and four. So you can do as many body waves as you want with doing only two, one is in four timing and the second one is only in two timing. So it's seven, eight, one, two for the first one, three, four for the second. One more time, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, one, two, three, tap, and five, six, seven, eight. Okay, follower. So for us, it's very important that we try to keep always the connection to the leader and that we don't do our body weights by our own. Also, don't lean on him, so we only have the connection as he already explained. You can also have a little bit of hip connection, but don't lean on him and make sure that both of you do very small steps. Yes, so now let's do it from the other point of view. From the beginning in seven, eight. One, two, three, tap. Five, six, seven, eight. One, two, three, tap, and five, six, seven, eight. If you like this video, make sure to give it a like. And also, if you want to learn Bachata Sensual with us, make sure to check out our online programs. The first link in the description. We hope to see you there and see you in the next video.